Somebody left a comment about uh, not being able to display variables in Game Maker Studio 2. So first let me just change the background because I don't like that uh, color. Purple. I like purple. Maybe a little darker. Just so we can see our text. So let's make a new object. Object 0. Use the sprite. There we go. Go to instances. And drag our object. Maybe you can make it bigger if you want to there we go so let's double click on the object let's add an event create let's make a variable first let's make a variable call it uh, each each you can call it whatever you want now the value here is set to zero okay but you can set this to whatever you want so i'm going to set this to 100 And uh, let's go to GUI. Let's go to draw. And uh, we're going to go to draw GUI. Graphic user interface. So fancy. Let's go down to drawn. And we're going to draw text. Okay. Now we could draw whatever we wanted. So for the value, we could draw um, something here. Let's just call this um, Sparkman. Okay, now for the position, I'm going to leave this at uh, zero, 00. Okay, so let's run this. You can see that um, it displays the text Sporkman. So instead of text, we want to display uh, our variable. So don't use the quotes, just simply type each, each, and that will display our variable. There you go. So let me delete that there and uh, let me use a transform value. Try um, HH and for the scale we're going to set this uh, to, uh, to 4. Okay. And let's try it out. And our text shows up a lot bigger. We can set it relative maybe minus 40 pixels so so it will be right above the character maybe a little higher 100 there we go now if you move this uh the text is going to move as well so let me show you now so if i um, press a key left jump to point Uh, say minus five pixels you can see that the text moves with our character let me do the uh, right direction just because we can copy event paste it take out the minus and let's try it out There you go. Now the uh, text follows our character. So uh, if that was your health bar, you could uh, display the uh, health, right? So let's decrease the value. So we're going to pretend our character takes on damage. So let me create a um, another event. Say if we press the... So if we press the up key... we can decrease the variable variable h h the value will be the value of the current variable minus 10 uh, let's press up and now my variable goes down now you can do all kinds of things with variables okay for example let me create a um, a step event 
going to throw an if statement if h h equals zero we can reset it back to um back to 100 okay 100 there we go uh we can also reset the position of the object once our variable reaches zero jump to point and we can select our um, position maybe maybe 200 and 200 on the y so we're around here somewhere and then we okay so that's the default position so there you go all right so the, you can do all kinds of things with um variables actually we are going to recreate an rpg game uh using these kind of variables all right so use the sparkman x tag if you play fortnite all right guys thanks for watching See you in the next video.